Hello, this is Shep here at Sun Valley Auto Club. We're going to be looking at this 1972 Cadillac. It is the Sedan DeVille. It does have the 472 cubic inch engine in it. That is the V8, of course. Automatic transmission, bronze exterior, autumn tan interior, um, air conditioning. It does have the original vinyl top on it. Uh, Michelin tires, 119,000 miles, 119,847. We'll take a closer look at that, but uh, the odometer has rolled. We have proof of that, uh, but low mileage all in all. Certainly not a uh, never used before car. I did have a Cadillac very similar. I think it had 30,000 original documented earlier this year. This one reminds me of that one in the sense of just how original it is. This is all original equipment except for a radio, uh, but original paint. I'll do a, I'll do a uh, paint meter uh, reading video on this one, uh, on this car, on a separate video. So ask me for that when you talk to me, uh, email me, etc. Uh, search it up on YouTube, but it'll be, uh, it'll be out there as well. But really amazing that it is uh, rust-free, original paint, and I can't wait to get into more of just the features of this car. What I do have, I wanna show you over here, is just some of the really cool documentation, original owner's manual, consumer information, and that lets me know who who owned the vehicle, and then all the current registration shows that it is his son, uh, same last name as well. So this car is an Idaho car, purchased um, up in the now defunct dealership up in Ketchum, Ketchum Motors. So it's been in our valley uh, in this town its whole life. We're really great, uh, great rust-free climate. We're in the high high mountain desert here, so great car preserving climate. One thing that I really dug too, going through the uh, um, more Michelin tire information, these guys are into their Michelins, is the um, some of the maps. I think in the 70s they took a uh, family trip to uh, California, San Diego, and check out this uh, brochure as well. San Diego Zoo and admission a buck. So, pretty good stuff there. I think currently it's $54 to get into the zoo for an adult, and you can quickly go up to over $100 if you want to do any of the uh, panda experiences or tiger experiences. So, anyway, <laughs> this is a time machine, and that brochure proves it as well. But all original, never been restored. The bright work is phenomenal. All your tail tail lights, all original equipment. And I guess that's the cool thing or the important thing about original paint, which I'll prove with that paint meter, is that um, you know none of this is reproduction. You know, there's no rust bubbling out on any level. And if it was a repaint, you never know. Does somebody do good body work? Do they cut out metal? They just do a sloppy job and just kind of smear some Bondwin over rust and it'll grow out. Just being original lets you know that this is just a no-hit car and it's going to hold up. It has held up with the test of time and it'll continue to do so. So this vinyl top is outrageous. The, uh, the pattern here is somewhere between burlap and, I don't know, rhino. Rhino skin, but excellent condition there. Good spot to look for rust in here. He's right below the windows, or the uh, the window trim in the back here. Because this really just collects water, even when you wash your car, and it tends to get under there, and you usually see all kinds of uh, rust bubbling through there. So just a fantastically dry car all the way throughout. And there's just one of those little spots that I was telling you about. You usually see the whole thing. So water just traveled there. 
and that's just even from a car wash. So one tiny little <clears throat> nub in there, but super solid car. The other thing is these cars are so dang long that if you start having to do body work, it's really tough to get them straight again. I mean, there's just acres of paint on this car. This triple brown tan look is awesome. The other thing with the four door, I've got the windows down. Those are of course all powered. I'll show you how those work. But when they're down, you're pillarless. You have no B pillar there and you've got the opera coupes. Original hubcaps, all your original lenses, turn signals, all your bright works in really great shape. And you will see, like this, this paint could really use a cut and a buff even, uh, a polish, I just haven't done that. But you will see some chips here and there from its use, 119,000 miles and over 45 years old. But certainly no dents, dings, damage uh, ever on this car. Interior, love how you got, uh, <laughs> I love, <laughs> this cigarette light is cracking up. But all your, all your interior lights work. Even glove box light. All your door lights, all your dome lights, all work. And then going back to the cigarettes, ashtrays and lighters, you've got uh, four lighters in there total. Smoke them if you got them. That was the philosophy back then. Everyone's got an ashtray. Beautiful fabric. I mean, I couldn't even begin to think about how much it would cost to try and replicate that in this day and age. But original interior. Oh, I haven't played with that. Those seats go up. I'm sure they just slide. I don't know if they even tilt because you do have uh, a fourth door back here. But beautiful, beautiful upholstery. All the stitching is immaculate. No damage on the back of the seats. We've got all the original uh, floor mats, but the carpet's in good shape. All the way through, door seals, really nice. And that's in every position. Headliner, ridiculous. I mean, it is just about mint. I don't know what would make it not mint, but mint's a pretty, uh, pretty big word to throw around. Big claim. I'm sure there's a flaw somewhere, but I can't see it. Once again, this is all factory. Nothing that's ever been taken apart. I'll take a look at the trunk. Maybe I'll combine the uh, paint, uh, paint meter, and we'll do the test drive on another video as well. So there'll be a lot more to come. Of course, trunk light works. I'd say that's a four body trunk. Carpet's in good shape. Once again, just the time machine of this car where you've got this cardboard, you do see some little nicks, but certainly no abuse. And that's just the originality of this. Original mat. See a lot of Mustangs, people replace Mustangs. There's a lot of cardboard insets in Mustangs. You usually see all that 
just brand new and nice because people want their cars looking good. Um, no reproduction parts on this. Not a reproduction sticker. It's just, it is what it is. So we're at the 10 minute mark. I'll open up the, I'll do a uh, paint meter reading. Engine start and test drive on the next video. This is Shep at the Sun Valley Auto Club. If you've got an interest in this Cadillac, you can call me and we can arrange transportation, uh, etc. You can do that by calling 208-721-1973, 208-721-1973.